there. What are you doing here? I thought it'd be a nice place to uh, stop, take a nap. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Well, what is this car? You've got another car. Oh, yeah, this is number, what, five? Four or uh, five. Five, I think. We didn't do a review on one of them. But this is the fourth review, fifth car. Uh-huh. Uh, so what is this? We've had, this is a Seat. Is that your favorite That's car? That's S in the front for Seat. Okay. We've had this is our third Seat. We've had two Opals, three Seats. Uh, Opals. Opals. Yeah, whatever. And um, uh, well, uh, this is the most basic Seat we've had. We've had some really nice ones. Well, we need them for four people, right? We need them for four people. This is, I mean, it's it's probably bigger than the Panda because. That's still the benchmark. Uh, it's a little bit bigger, but in many ways it's, it's similar. It's got your, uh, your one liter, three cylinder, yeah, three cylinder. It's the first gasoline engine we've had. Really? Yeah. And it was interesting. I don't know how really full that tank was. You know, the gauge said full. Right. And we drove about 120 miles before the gauge moved. Wow. So I'm thinking we're getting good mileage. Yeah, I guess so. So, yeah, we're, <laughs> it's only a two day rental. And this is day two, so we're turning in today. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop it because it's kind of windy here and I want to see how bad it sounds. Okay, it seems less windy here. Let's, uh, uh, where were we? Yeah, that was my question. Where were we? <laughs> Uh, we're we're talking, in. Oh, we we're comparing we're, it to the panda. Weren't right, we? right. We're, we're in Spain, right. and you were comparing it to the panda. And, yeah. yeah. You know, it, it's bigger than the panda. Uh huh. Uh, probably, you know, but, but it's uh, your basic automobile. No bells and whistles. Right. Really. I mean, a tiny little screen in there, and no cruise control, no this, no that. Uh, it handles fine, not much power. Uh, what size one. engine did you say? One liter, uh, three cylinder, and it's a, a V You want to get that? Yeah, yeah. And, uh, uh, and how do you open that to trunk? I don't see it. Well, any. that was a little problem. Really? Yeah. Yeah, because, you know, they gave us the keys and they said, oh, I thought it was parked out front here, but I guess, and, oh, I guess it's up the street and go down and it's parked on the street someplace. And we got there and I'm trying to... How do you open the darn thing? I mean, the darn thing. And uh, you came along and did that. <laughs> so you can see here, well, well, I've got it open here. You can see there's enough room for two suitcases. Two suitcases. And yeah, that's about a it. A little bit more. But that's all we need. Yep. You want to see the powerful engine? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I haven't looked at it. I'm curious. I'm curious to what it looks like. Small. As opposed to some of the others where you can't you open it up and you don't know. There seems like there's a bit more space in there. Look, there's room for an extra battery. Well, definitely a bigger battery. So, it is a three cylinder, I see. Straight three. Gotcha. Turn it in later today on the North Sp North Spanish coast. Is that what you said? Wrong with it, but it's just not that fun. Right. And it's, it's uh, you know, of the seats we've had. It's the uh, least got the fewest features. Yep. Nice setting. Uh, yeah, Sun shining too. Sun shining. Which is unusual for this trip. Yeah. 
All right, well, so you still have one more car on this trip to give me a review of, right? Yeah, did you want to Yeah. Okay. All right.